Hi there. Well, this is the third time I'm making this video, so uh, I have to start recording it uh, separately, then converting it and uploading it, because this just doesn't work. I'm playing around with some electronics. I have this device. I bought it. It's a DC-DC converter. I think it's a very useful thing. It's very cheap. It's about $2 or $3 on eBay. And what it does, it allows you to use a 12-volt solar panel, which doesn't put out 12 volt, but puts out something between 12 and 25 volts. Uh, turn that voltage into uh, exactly the voltage that you need at also exactly the current that you need, but I haven't been able to verify that yet. That's very useful because your devices are not uh, accepting uh, 15 volt one minute and 9 volt the other minute. has to be exactly what it's uh, supposed to be. And solar panels simply don't produce that. Usually when you have them combined with an inverter, then you get 220 or 110 or something like that, AC, and you can use that. But this is much cheaper. It's like this is a few dollars instead of like $500 for an inverter. So uh, I'm charging a battery with it. These things are also have a battery, battery charging uh, light, but I'm still uh, asking how that works. And it means that I can have a solar panel, have a 5 volt output for my electronics, have a 12 volt output directly from the solar panel or 25 volt, whatever, for a motor. And I can build some more uh, interesting devices with it that I'm working on right now. I also have to reconstitute the, 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 the heliostat that I was building last year uh, and show you about the magneto ro magnetic rotary encoders. I want to uh, I will keep this video short because, let's say, the transmission breaks off. It doesn't ever happen, but only with YouTube. Uh, I wrote an article a while back called Hypertransparency, and I think hypertransparency is the way to go. Uh, it is uh, basically, and as a term I think it should be promoted, uh, I've been promoting it. People talk about transparency where companies have to reveal secrets, but I say hypertransparency means that you cannot run a company without opening up everything you do. There's really no secrecy necessary in business. You don't need secrets to run a business. Uh, even a casino can run its business without keeping uh, secrets. Secrets are basically, they, they creeped into business when uh, when it got a lot a lot of trading started to happen. And what secrets do is they, uh, they mask human rights abuses, they mask pollution, they mask, uh, uh, let's say, uh, and limit the, the, the limit to uh, what we have. So oil companies are non-transparent about the reserves. They should be hyper-transparent about their operations, and you would be less, a lot less uh, uh, relaxed about the oil future. Uh, so, so that should all be ditched. And in, and in an article I point out that Twitter is an example of a, a, a medium for hyper-transparency. Why? Because Twitter uh, records tweets uh, with the date and the second that they are tweeted for everybody to see. There's really no way Twitter restricts visibility of tweets. Uh, and so there should be like a WikiLeaks, should there be uh, a wiki tweets. And if you want to be an above the table uh, uh, company, operate above, uh, let's say, on the level with democratic society, you should start, uh, let's say, tweeting uh, or publishing everything you do, your phone calls, your emails, your, your, your accounting, etc. Anyway, uh, I'll link to the video or to the article because otherwise this video might break off and not uh, upload and I'll try to find another way to make videos. Thanks for listening.